Well, there was frustration this afternoon here at Kings Lynn. What was your assessment? Uh, really disappointed. You know, the game plan leading into the game, the work that was fed into the players, um, was dealing with transitions in and out of possession and set plays. And ultimately, we've, we've conceded the goals on set plays. So, yes, it's frustrating because we've had the game plan, you know, two minutes in straight away. It's come to life, but fair play to the players. You know, they've stuck at it. We've tried to get on the ball. Yes, the scoreline doesn't look great and we'll take that on the chin, you know, we'll, we'll be accountable for conceding three and not scoring. But some of the football we've played, the desire and the work rate of the players to still keep going, you know, shows what type of characters they actually are and they're hurting in there and they can't wait for Tuesday, we can't wait for Tuesday now. You know, big game on Tuesday against Leamington, that we, we want to put things right. It was a real double, double whammy early on, wasn't it? Not only conceding the goal, but also losing the player so early in the game and Michael Ledger having to come off, at, you know, at all is everything that you've, you've set up to do. Yeah, I mean, Michael was superb, you know, um, last week and you know he's a good player and naturally he is going to be a miss but to change the game plan and personnel so early and to concede as early as what we did as well um, hasn't hasn't helped the situation one little bit but hey, there's no excuses there's no excuses we're not we're not pointing the finger at anything other than ourselves we'll all look in the mirror we'll all roll our sleeves up and we'll all just try and work a little bit harder to put it right for everybody at the club you talked about how well they played at times and there was a period did you feel a, a, a key period in the second half just before they scored the second goal where we'd really built up ahead of steam and and had we got the goal then it might have been a completely different picture yeah i mean we, we talked about it quite a bit you know the character in the dressing room it shows you know the amount of times we're going behind the amount of times we're conceding the way we, we stick at it the way we keep playing we keep saying it, it's testament to everybody at the club it's testament to the players their attitude to keep doing that and um, but ultimately it hasn't worked today you know we'll take it on the chin and realistically we cannot wait for Tuesday now. And as you say the scoreline doesn't really reflect the, the balance of the game does it which is it's a hard one to take and a hard one to ponder on the on the long journey home. Yeah but no, no one likes losing you know and yes the scoreline 3-0 you know, it, it's hard to explain for those that weren't here you know some of the football that we have played has been good you know we have got a game plan we have tried to work at it ultimately to concede as early as what we have in both halves really um, you know, the, the sucker punches, but to keep going till the end and, and getting into areas, John's getting into some areas. You know, Blackie's had a couple of half chances, so we've, we've kept going, but th there's no excuses from anybody here. You know, good luck to Kings Lynn, and, you know, we, we'll take it on the chin, and like I keep saying, Lemon and then two home games now, you know, they mean a lot to us, and we're very, very focused on that. Uh, just a, a final word maybe on the on the supporters who made such a long trip, we know exactly how long it is, and, and fantastic fun to follow on down here. Yeah, they're, they're superb home in a way. You know, it, it means a lot to us. We're very appreciative for what they do. They travel, you know, they make a lot of noise. The home games are the same. But for them to jump on the bus and, and to travel down here, you know, shows what we're about and where we're going and, and what we want to bring to this club is success for people like that. People are off, off the pitch as well as on the pitch.